when I'm doing a strict dumbbell row, I want to fail at the muscular level as soon as possible. I don't want to get um, out of breath or anything like that. So I'm going to row 70 pounds, and this is something I could um, row for 20, 30 reps if I just allow my body to move how it wants to move and use some momentum. I'm probably going to fail around nine to 10 reps because I'm going to keep as much tension in my grip as possible. I'm going to squeeze my arms as hard as I possibly can. I'm going to stretch my lats at the bottom and I'm going to flex them as hard as I possibly can trying to get that dumbbell up to my hip. I'm going to be as intense about it as I possibly can. And even though I'm anticipating where I will fail, uh, it will be authentic because I'm putting such tight parameters on how the movement has to be done. Therefore, I will reach fatigue a lot sooner. That kind of effort is what you need when you're doing these supplemental bodybuilding type movements. Make things as hard as possible. The weight doesn't really matter so much as the execution. <laughs> 